he's back. The man, the myth, the legend, Chris Cox is back at Coventry United. And Coxie, you couldn't have started any better tonight. Uh, yeah, you know, freaking wasn't expecting to start at all. Obviously, been away from freaking travelling, been a long time out. Uh, just trying to get fit again, do things right. But, you know, T's got a good team, so I don't expect to walk straight back in no chance. But why have you decided to return to the Red and Greens after two seasons away? Uh, to be fair, it's, it's a bit of a tough question, really. Freaking, I was at Tamworth, then decided to go travelling, had to go and obviously get that off my chest. But, you know, it's always the team. It's the team that I freaking kind of grew up with, the team that I had promotions with. Um, obviously, Terry's one of my very, very close friends. The lads are class. So I was, uh, I actually just came down to get some fitness, and that's how it started off. And the more the scouse gets in your head, the more it freaking rubbed off. Uh, he sorted something out and he's he, he's happy for me to be here. I'm happy to be here for now. I've got a lot of things going on in the background, so it kind of works right. Well, you're back after, as you say, a short sabbatical from football. You're doing a little bit of travelling. But what was it the right time to return to the pitch? Uh, when you've had seven months off football and you've been travelling and seen some of the places and stuff like that, you get a chance to clear your head. You get a chance to actually start enjoying the game again. And that's all it is for me. It's not about playing at where I could play at a higher level back again. It's just about just enjoying it and around a local team, around people already knew for years and obviously again Terry being my close pal, it kind of made sense. Well you're a familiar face to many a red and green, a club legend, a former captain. Are you hoping to add to your already storied legacy? Oh, who wouldn't? Who wouldn't? Another promotion this year. You know, you can't tell me that you'll ever get sick of winning games. You ever get can't tell me that you get sick of scoring goals or Whatever, you know, you, you've got to love it. So, yeah, obviously, I'm not here to just to sit and um, be part of the furniture now as, a, as a, a legend, as they say. I'm just a player. I'm just here just to make make a squad. Well, how's the team changed in your time where we've seen players come and go, coaches come and go? What are the big, biggest changes since uh, you left the club? Um, I'll be honest with you, the lads. The lads, you know, it, it went for a stage of where people were coming and going, especially when I was there. Partly the reason why I left. Um, just, just so much was going on back then. But the togetherness with the team now—that's the one thing I can say is probably better than when I was here before. The, the togetherness from the team and the lads is just fucking—it's frightening to be fair. How far they could go with it. Well, during your time away, as you said, you lined up for the likes of Tamworth, uh, Stratford Town as well, uh, steps four and three respectively. How have you benefited from your experience in these leagues? Yeah, I mean, playing the higher leagues, it, it, it does. It's crazy. It actually does give you so much knowledge when you come back and play these kind of leagues. Um, it, it, it is what it is. It's such a faster-paced game in the in two leagues above. I know people say it isn't, but you're playing with a bit of quality players and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, just you can only bring it down and bring it to the younger lads here. Well, they're turning the lights on, so we'll have to wrap it up in a minute. But uh, finally, what are your hopes and expectations for yourself and for the squad this season? Uh, myself, just carry on enjoying football. Get fit. Get fit as I used to be. Get fit as I was friggin' just before I left. I was probably at my fittest then. And for the more than anything, for the team, for the fans, yourselves, to win the league. There's no other comparison to winning the league. You know, a player here, yeah, you can have your own things as a goal tally, as a clean sheet tally. You know, it happens. But as a team, collectively, it's to win the league. Well, Coxley, I think we've everyone want to say it's amazing to have you back. Welcome back, mate. Cheers, mate. Nice one.